good morning students in this session we are going to learn how to work with templates in django so what is a template in django and how can we specify html file or html code in django so generally we overcome the problem of separating the html code from use.py file into a separate html file which is nothing but a template so generally from use.py file we can use these templates based on our requirements that is we can write our html code in a separate file and call from the use.py file this HTML code has to be placed in a folder name called templates. Now, what are the steps? Creation of the project, creation of the Django application and adding our application name in settings.py file and creating the templates folder in the project and providing the base underscore directory path to mention the absolute path. Here, we are not going to specify the relative path which is not recommended by the programmer. Now, finally, starting the server. Now, what are the things to be added in settings.py file? We are going to import the OS package and we are going to add the base directory and we are going to add the base directory to the templates folder so that os.path.join will combine both our base directory and templates. Now, I open my VS code. Now, so this is my project and this is my application. Now, in my application, I am going to create a folder. So, here in the application, I am going to create a folder with a name called templates. So let me write the name as templates. Now, so in the templates folder, I am going to create an HTML file. So here I am going to add a new file. Let me say my file name is results.html. Now, in this HTML, I am going to add my HTML code. So I, I open my HTML code and I will add my HTML code here. And here you can clearly see that I am going to add a style tag to represent certain settings for my output. So background, color and as well as border also. Now in the body tag, I am going to mention, hello, this is the response and server date and time. And I am going to get the values of name, roll number and marks. These three values are obtained from views.py file. Now I opened my views.py file. So in views.py file, I am going to write a function with a name called template underscore view. And I'm going to use a variable called DT, which I'm going to get the value of date and time. And I'm going to write my name, my roll number and my marks. And all these values are forwarded to a directory, I mean dictionary. I mean to say, so what is a dictionary? Dictionary consists of a key value pair. So date, date, that is name is a key and a name is a value. And roll number is the key and roll number is the value. And marks is the key and marks is the value. And finally, I'm going to render this request to results.html file so that the dictionary values are obtained here in results.html file. Now what is an urls.py file? Simply I have mentioned my first app.urls and I am going to mention path nothing here. And urls.py file of my application, I am going to add my view name that is views.template underscore view. Here name I can mention as template underscore view. Now I am going to open settings.py file and I am going to add these settings here. So let me add my settings here. So here the first setting I have added is import OS. So let me delete and add once again. So here. So this is my settings.py file. So in my settings.py file, I'm going to add the entire things. So let me add my first thing. So I will open my PPT and I'm going to add this. So first one import OS. So in settings.py file, add import OS. Next. And also add the base directory. So here I'm going to add my base directory. Yes, the base directory is also added. And finally, I'm going to add the DIRS option as like this. So here I'm going to add os.path of base directory. So here I mentioned my os.path.join of base directory and templates. The base directory predefined value which I mentioned here is this. So it's a default value which consists of os.path of our directory name so that the Django will recognize the templates folder in the entire system. Now I am going to save this and I am going to start my server. So I am going to run my server. Yes, I am going to start the deployment server. So 127.0.0.82000. I am going to press the enter. So let me save the file once again. Use.py, urls.py and results.html I haven't saved here. So I'm going to refresh. Yes, you can clearly see that welcome to templates. Hello, this is the response from the server. And I have also get my name, roll number and password. So in this way, we can use the templates in Django.
Thank you.